Hi everybody, in this video I'm going to show you how to make a uh, real basic HTML contact form without doing any programming and I'm going to show you how to do it just in a couple minutes, uh, maybe even less than five minutes using my uh, formmailhosting.com tool. So you can head on over to formmailhosting.com, go set yourself up a free account and as soon as you set up your account you're going to see a, uh, a form real similar to this, it's going to pop up to have you build your first uh, contact form. And the first thing you're going to want to do is give your form a name. Uh, this one is for my uh, YouTube driver. It's a uh, YouTube uh, downloading product. And I just put in the form name here that it's, uh, it's I want to get questions back from the website. So I just want people to contact me and uh, ask me a question if they're having problems with the software or not. So uh, here's my email. That's where I want the uh, contact form results sent to. And the thank you page URL, uh, I've just got it set to formmailhosting.com right now. But what's really nice is you can put, you, you can make just a page on your website that says thank you. And as soon as they fill out the form and hit submit, it'll go right to that page. So if you don't want people to know you're using formmailhosting.com, you can totally do that. And uh, they'll never know you're using the site. Uh, what do I want the uh, text on the button to send? Um, you, you could have it say send contact form. I just have mine said uh, to say send now. And do you want us to host the form or do you want to do it? Uh, for this tutorial, let's put, you're going to put the code on your own website. Okay, so that's it. You just hit uh, continue to step two. And in step two here, you're going to be able to add your different uh, contact form fields. Uh, I wanted their name. Uh, you got to put an email field here. Um, that way you'll be able to reply to the emails. So when you're sending an email and someone fills out a form, if they've got a question, you can just hit reply. It'll go right back to them. But if you don't put an email in there, that won't happen. So make sure you at least collect their email address. Um, I added another form and I did it a drop down choice and I'll show you that in a second. But basically, this gives them a choice that if they already purchased it, if they're using a free trial, or if they're a paying customer. And to get the different uh, options, and this is a drop-down box right here. You see how it has different choices? To get those choices is set up, I just typed in one, please select, then I hit return. I typed in no, I'm using the free trial, I hit return. So, so just by entering one per line, you're going to get your different choices to set up. And then I have a question here. I want to do that one as a multi-line so they can type in free text and I want that to be 40 characters wide and 10 rows deep and I can add more uh, fields if I want but for this tutorial I'm just going to use those three so then I'm going to move over to step number three here and maybe I want to send them a, uh, a quick thank you email I just check this box and what's going to happen is uh, when they fill out the form it's going to send an email back from me to them just saying that hey I got your form and I'm gonna get back to you as soon as possible so if you want to send them a thank you message uh, that's one way to do it uh, pretty neat feature a lot of people like so that's it I just hit finish here and here's my HTML code and I just put this right on my web page I don't have to do any programming at all and I just take it and copy let's go into Dreamweaver here that's the product I like to use for doing my web design Okay, so this is where it'll go. And I already put the form in here ahead of time. But basically, you can see they're going to enter their name, their email, uh, did they purchase or not, and another question, and hit send. We can take a quick look at the code here. Um, but all I did is I started, I just right here, do not modify below this line. And I got to the bottom of my form right here. And I just pasted in the code just like that. And that's all there is to it. So basically, you can get a uh, very basic uh, HTML form, a contact form that you can put on your website. You notice I didn't do any programming. And incidentally, how I came across building this tool is um, I've been programming for years and I had a whole ton of uh, web clients and they always needed contact forms and I just quite frankly got sick of writing the same code over and over so that's why I decided to build this tool it's just a real quick way for you uh, to add contact forms survey forms different kind of forms that uh, that you can put on your website so in any case uh, head on over to formmailhosting.com you can go set up a free account give it a try and uh, if you have any problems um, Let's see where is it at here you can hit the support link right up here and uh, use a contact form actually to send me an email and I'll get back to you and help you uh, get it working on your site uh, thanks again for watching this video and hope to see you soon